Welcome to Legal Minutes, where we explain a legal concept in 60 seconds or less. Those following the SEC Ripple lawsuit know that both a U.S. federal district judge and a U.S. federal magistrate judge are involved in the case. Do you know the difference between the two? A district judge is nominated by the president and is confirmed by the U.S. Senate. Under Article 3 of the U.S. Constitution, district judges are appointed for life. Magistrate judges are appointed for eight-year terms by a majority vote of the active district judges in a particular federal district. The authority given to magistrate judges varies from court to court. In the SEC Ripple case, the district judge gave only part of the case to a magistrate. Just the pretrial proceedings, including discovery, non-dispositive pretrial motions, and potential settlement talks. That is why you see the magistrate making rulings on various evidentiary disputes, but it was the district judge that ruled on the defendant's motion to dismiss, which is a dispositive motion that could have ended the case. We'll talk more about motions to dismiss in a future segment. Please share and subscribe, and until next time, stay out of trouble.